Hey everyone, Alan here with a quick tutorial on how to create a recurring Zoom meeting uh, inside of your Talon course. This is primarily for those instructors who have regularly scheduled meeting times through Zoom for their class. So the first step would be to log into your class. I'm here in a dev section, but obviously you'd go into your credit section and then click on the Zoom tab at the top of the screen. From there, it's going to load your um, your Zoom account. And if you don't have a Zoom account already, it should automatically create one for you. If you get an error at this stage, just shoot me an email and we'll try to get that fixed for you. Um, but if everything goes well and everything's associated with your account, you should see a schedule a new meeting here at the side. Click that blue button, schedule a new meeting, and you're taken to the new meeting uh, dialog box. Uh, so from here, you can name your new meeting, obviously, uh, you want to name this specific to what uh, your your class is and by default it's going to load the name of the class in here for you but maybe you want to put in zoom meeting or something along the lines of class time or something like that um, description can be blank i haven't found a way that students can see what's in there anyway so it doesn't make sense to load it uh, from here you can tell it when the meeting's going to start uh, which day of the week uh, let's see we start the 31st here and maybe my class meets at 2 p.m and if it did meet at like i don't know 2 10 i can type that in directly uh, for that meeting start time i can't type in uh, meeting minute times though so if you are have if you do have a 50 minute or 55 minute class just set it for an hour and that's totally fine that'll work the best um, and then you want to check this recurring meeting checkbox make sure you're in central time that should default accordingly but just make sure that doesn't change um, and then inside the recurring meeting you want to set this to probably weekly um, most of our classes meet weekly and maybe i have a class that meet, meets on monday wednesday friday so i would select monday wednesday uncheck the thursday if that's checked for you automatically like mine was uh, and check the friday um, and then uh, how often are you meet or how how long does your class go for? Uh, maybe this is a full term class, which doesn't end until December uh, 14, I think it is. Um, it's telling me I now have 45 occurrences of this meeting, so that's totally fine. And uh, I think there is a hard limit of 50 right now. So if you do have more meetings than that, you may need to schedule more than one meeting, uh, do some kind of work around. Um, Registration is not usually required, but password and or waiting room are one of those two has to be enabled. So it's not a bad idea to have both. Um, and then uh, you can adjust the settings down below as you see fit. Um, if you don't want any students joining before you join, you can uncheck that checkbox. If you want to mute everybody uh, when they first get into your uh, meeting time, uh, you can check that checkbox and so on. If you do have other uh, instructors who are going to be helping out with your meeting, um, maybe you want to enter in their uh, email address here um, so that they can be an alternative host uh, for the meeting. Uh, you just enter in their email address and they'll get that invitation. They, they'll be able to launch from your class as well that same meeting to host to be a host of that meeting. When you're done, click on save and that will schedule that meeting and uh, you'll you'll see that show up here um, inside the Zoom tab. If I click back on the Zoom tab, now I have all of those meetings scheduled. Uh, you can edit those meetings just by clicking on them if you need to. Uh, you can also find all of those meetings now will be on the calendar in the, in, the, um, in the class as well. So it automatically adds things to the calendar. Any adjustments you make will be adjusted in both places. So if you adjust that Zoom meeting on the Zoom tab, it will also be adjusted here under the, the calendar. Uh, so don't worry too much about that. And that's about it. Let us know if you have questions. We're here to help. Thanks.